I wish to be acknowledged not as black, but as white. Who but a white woman can do this for me? By loving me, she proves I am worthy of white love. I am loved like a white man. The following content was inspired by the slave-themed wedding photo shoot that has gone viral since its posting on social media. The full-length video is one hour long and is available to my members and patrons. The excerpts that you are about to listen to are black men spanning over a time of 60 to 100 years, speaking about their thoughts on relationships and sex with white women. If you find the content disturbing, you're not the only one. But I'm hoping this will open up a wider discussion. If you're interested in seeing the full one-hour video, you can do so on my Patreon or Memberships page. I am a white man. Her love takes me on to the noble roads that leads to total realization. I marry white culture, white beauty, white whiteness. When my restless hands caress those white breasts, they grasp white civilization and dignity and make them mine. The white male both places the white woman on a pedestal and victimizes her. Just the way the black male is victimized. This makes them natural allies. Their mutual attraction derives in part from a subconscious wish to break taboos. My crushes in high school were all white girls. I used to fantasize about asking them out, kissing them, fucking them. It was about the only way by which I judged my social value, by how many of them I was of interest to. In fact, the first girl to ever hear the words, I love you, from me, was a white girl. For cis heterosexual black men, we must remember the search for place is often the search again to become white men, to sit at the head of privilege and power. Snoop sees in Stewart as many black men see in many white women, his own face. Snoop is a white woman, insofar as white women want to be white men. I am just analyzing the cliches about sexuality. Interracial sexuality is a good subject, and I happen to be looking for that kind. At first, I wanted to destroy those cliches. How naive of me. It didn't take me long to come to a conclusion that literally terrified me. Most of the cliches about sex between black men and white women are true. 